So why don't you tell me a little bit about um, what you do and uh, and and why why you are here in, in the Netherlands? Yeah. Okay. So my name is Michel Balans. Okay. <laughs> Uh, I live in Chiang Mai, Thailand, which is like the second city in Thailand, in, in the mountains. Mm -hmm. And I'm a member and founder of a foundation, it's called the Foundation for Peer-to-Peer -peer Alternatives. Okay. And basically what we're doing is documenting, researching and promoting peer-to-peer -peer alternatives. Okay. And so basically what I've been doing here in Amsterdam is uh, talking to people, giving seminars, lectures about how P2P is not just technology, but really uh, a new way of doing things, a new way of being in the world, uh, and, you know, just kind of a, the taste of the next society, in a way. So what's peer-to-peer yeah. -peer itself? Yeah. I mean, so peer-to-peer, -peer, um, you know, the word peer means more or less equal. Mm -hmm. right? So peer-to-peer -peer is... Um, the re it's a little bit difficult, the definition, the relational dynamic in distributed networks. So where, wherever you have a network of people mm -hmm. where you have no coercion, in other words, no uh, no obligations, no limitations to how you can connect to other people, mm -hmm. once you have that, then you have a kind of bottom-up relationship that starts uh, between those people in a network. And those relationships are peer-to-peer -peer networks. So you, you get three different things with that. You get peer production, that's when those people start deciding to do something in common, to produce something. You know, think of Linux, think, think of Wikipedia, think of you know the I don't know how many billions of pages you can find on, on Google which are produced by people together. Uh, the second thing is well how do they actually manage that? You know, given that they're doing all those things, how do they manage those relationships? I call that peer governance, so governing the peer to peer projects. And the third thing is peer property which is Okay, how do you protect it from individual appropriation or corporate appropriation? So, if you decide to do something together, how do you make sure it stays for everybody rather than, you know, kind of benefit only to a few?